If you work with multiple user accounts on your editing system, what happens if you forget the password for one of the users? This becomes a problem if that particular user has left critical files on the desktop. Even an administrator will not be able to access the other user's desktop. Fortunately, you can activate the super user or root account. You'll then be able to retrieve data from that particular user's desktop. To do this, navigate to the Apple menu and select System Preferences. Within the System Preferences window, click on the Accounts icon. Click onto one of your administrator accounts and select Login Options. Click on the Join button for the Network Account Server. Then click on the Open Directory Utility. Within the Directory Utility window, click on the Lock to make changes. Under the Edit menu, choose Enable Root User. Give the root user a password. With the root user now enabled, you need to log out of your account. You should now see an Other User button after you log out of your account. Type root for the username, and then specify your password assigned to the root account. When you are logged into the root account, you can now freely access other users' desktops. I recommend moving the files from the previous user's desktop to the shared folder. So when you log back in as another user, you'll be able to access the files. That's it. For other great tips like this, or to enroll in a video editing training class, visit GeniusDV.com.